so hey guys, it's Sage Aspen Miss Eleven. My parents surprised me with a dollhouse last night, so I'm gonna show you what's on each floor. This will be kitchen and living room. So kinda like that. Okay, some of that stuff. The middle floor is going to be where I put my bunk bed and Kit's little bed. And then up here is another bedroom. And the other shelf didn't really fit on top. So we are going to like just build like a slanted roof up to so that'll be cool and um I'm going to get my bunk bed split up so yeah so thanks for watching this portion of this video hey guys um it's Monday night and yeah so this is what it looks like right now um in the bottom the bottom floor is 26 inches so we need to move this shelf down some because the bunk bed that is going to go in here is 24. i think that's like to the top of it so it's big and you know there's going to be the two beds and then that one but those two are going to be on top of each other to give us a little more space in this floor. And up here there's gonna be eight, not eight, four dolls. And then this is the, what I, we got for the walls. It's like heavyweight poster board. And then we got this contact paper for the bottom floor. And the way all the stuff from the middle floor is on the bottom or the top, but mostly the top. Mommy. My mother's climbing in my dollhouse. So, hey guys, I have two walls up now, so I've been working on them. So, this is the bottom floor. That wall still needs to get put in, but these two are up. I like them so far, and then I still have, like, t ten of them to use. So I can use one there, one there, two there, one there. So that's two, three, four, five, five, six, seven, eight, nine, oh. Probably use all of them though. I don't know. And the bunk bed still isn't cut up. This floor is like nothing. Which, yeah, this is what it looks like so far. So I'll update you when that wall is filled. Update, I have gotten nothing done in here. And, yeah. But the bunk beds are separated slightly. Um, my dad's cutting the top one because there was like a lot of, like just bare wood that wasn't painted. So, yeah, this is what it looks like right now. This is going to get cut a little bit because it like just fits. And I'd like to have a little, bit, a little bit more space than that, so a doll can actually lay up there. And this is the way they're all laying around my room right now. Yeah, you can kind of hear the sound noises. <laughs> my room's a mess from the walls, and I have my contact paper for the bottom floor in my closet, but I haven't even thought about the floors really yet. I mean, I know what I'm going to do, but I haven't thought about how I'm going to do that yet. That's like the least of my concern. The walls and the bunk beds are <clears throat> my main concern right now. Yay! That bed's cut up. Um, Ruthie 
Lainey, Harper, and Jenna's room is sort of ready. That room is, that one down, the room down there is all the way ready. But I just need to paint the walls. Um, I need to get paint and then paint the walls. And then this floor isn't really close to being ready yet. This one really just needs walls and the other bed and then it'll be good. It's nothing to do with dolls, but look at our street. Ew. And then this, and then the bunk bed isn't gonna get cut up yet. My dad said he'll do that later. That's all he's doing for now, but yay. So this floor is partially done. Bam, got the walls up. Now I just get the bunk bed and the floor is done. By the way, I still need to paint, but in this floor the walls are awful because there's like this thing sticking out and I put stuff on there so it stays, but it's not really staying and not bending well. So this wall, just kinda wish they were a little sturdier. Maybe for this wall. It looks awful, but it works. And then this is the way the middle floor is going to be. Although I really think that there will be enough space for something different there. I don't know what it's going to be, but that'll be a bunk bed. Let me put the locker there. We'll probably put it down here. I don't know. But I got the walls done. I'm going to have to come up with a different way to get this, these walls up though. Although I'm not going to do anything about it now. So I kind of solved my problem with the walls being weird. Just taped them down at the bottom and then a little bit, and then like in the corners. And then I need to do it up here because this part is not going, up here it's not going well. But down here it works. And down here, this is like the best floor because... You know, it reaches the top for all of them and it stays up well, so yeah, I'll update when you, you when I'm done.